Oh, oh my god. Well, that's sizzling right away. Okay, we're gonna place this down. Oh, I'm like so nervous. According to this video, you could take a huge thing of ice and make an ice waffle with a waffle maker to form crazy chocolate shapes. I'm gonna give it a try, see does it actually work, and can you do this at home? All right, over here I have a waffle maker that is nice and hot. Just to show you, listen to that, immediately melting right over there. So now I'm gonna take this ice. Now this is a big cube of ice that I froze in the freezer, and this is going to become our mold for our chocolate. So we're just gonna take this, ready for it? Okay, I'm like nervous. I don't even know if you could actually do this. Like, is this safe? Is this something that like is, is okay? Is this recommended? Probably not. Oh, oh my God. Well, that's sizzling right away. Okay, we're gonna place this down. Oh, I'm like so nervous. Place this down here. Okay, right in there. Now, can we even close this? No, not really. Maybe we'll just try to waffle the bottom side. I think the idea is that by pushing it down, it's going to melt that water and then it's going to form a beautiful shape that we can then form our chocolate on. Let's see, we're gonna do that here, just like that. And while that goes, let's melt our chocolate. Now it's time to melt the chocolate. Just place the chocolate right into a double boiler. As you can see, I have a little bit of water over there that is simmering. It's going to very gently melt our chocolate. So just stir that up until fully melted. Melt, 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 and just look at that beautiful, beautiful chocolate ready to be poured on our waffle. All right, I think this is ready. Let's see, I'm going to take this. Let's just lift this up. Has it formed a shape? Oh, oh boy. Okay, wait a second, this is working. Whoa, whoa, this is working, but look at that. We actually have a waffle shape that is formed right there. Can you believe that? Look at that, a beautiful waffle shape. Let's just, can you like see all this texture? Let's lift it right over here. Look at that. You have all those little dips and divots. We literally have now made a mold for our chocolate in the shape of a waffle. Okay, I'm sorry. That's not cool that I don't know what it is. That worked swimmingly well. Now, over here I have my chocolate that is now melted. And I guess the idea is that you're gonna take your chocolate, ready for it, okay? And we're just going to pour the chocolate right onto there and hopefully form a waffle shape. So you wanna just pour that chocolate slow, get it in all those little grooves. You're gonna really try to make this chocolate into a waffle shape. I'm like shocked how well this is going. I did not think this would work at all. I thought this ice would just melt immediately and become a mess, but no, it is literally just becoming a waffle. So we're gonna place that here, place that here. Beautiful. Now, I guess we're just gonna let this sit. And once that firms up, it will hopefully turn into a waffle shape. All right, I'm not actually gonna pop this into the freezer. I feel like that's the only way we'll actually firm up. So let's just leave it as that and see what happens. All right, I just got this out of the freezer and look at that. Nice and firmed up. So I'm now just going to try to go under there with, oh, oh boy, ready for it? Okay, ready for it, wait, I'm gonna take a peek. Let me see it, ready? Okay, that's cool. Do you wanna see it? Shall I show you? Okay, first off, before I show you the chocolate, look, it still has that shape. So you could reuse this mold. This mold is reusable, you can use it more than once. You wanna see it? You wanna see what it looks like? Should I show you? I think I should. You've been so patient this whole time. Ready for it? Three, two, one, come on. Look at that. Is that not a unique piece of chocolate? That is a beautiful shape. Now you can use this for any type of dessert. I've seen people use this as a way they could like put this on a plate and then top it with scoops of ice cream and drizzle and everything. This is a great way to enjoy your chocolate and come on. Who knew you could easily make a waffle shaped chocolate using a huge chunk of ice? Come on, did you know that? I didn't know that, but guess what? We know it now.